The Senate Committee on Army has called for more cooperation of the Nigerian Army in terms of performing their constitutional role and their legislative duties as it affects legislative reforms and to enhance reposition of the Nigerian Army as well as the welfare of the troops and development of Nigeria Army in general. The Chairman Senate Committee on Army said this when he led members of the Senate Committee on Army on a medium familiarization visit to the Chief of Army Staff at the Army Headquarters in Abuja. As mandated by the Constitution. However, I want to also seek your cooperation so that we synergize and ensure that whatever is required by the Army to operate and ensure the safety of lives of Nigerians and Nigeria. We need your cooperation in terms of performing our own constitutional role of our legislative duties as it affects legislative reforms enhance budgeting of the Nigerian army as well as the welfare of the troops and the development of the army in general. Senator Yad Udwa noted that the committee needed cooperation of the Nigerian army to synergize and to ensure that whatever is required by the army to operate to ensure the safety of lives are provided. About the development of Nigerian army as a whole. The objective of the agenda, the objective is that we want to first of all use it to ensure that we perform our legislative duties and role and then try as much as possible to develop the Nigerian army through that agenda so that we have a document, a working document with timelines as to what we want to achieve within the next four years as, as committee on army. That's why we decided there was need for the Nigerian army to give its own input because we need to know what they want. We have now said this, these are the things we think can move the Nigerian army forward. So we want them to now come up with some of the things that they think they need. You know, so we add to that and have a full document that both the committee and the Nigerian army will work together to ensure that we achieve it. Because you, you don't come as a committee you know, and you don't have what you want to do. So that's why we set an agenda for ourselves and for the army. The chief of Amherst staff in his remarks stressed that the Nigerian army recognized the critical role of the legislators in effective functioning of the military and the committee is critical to performance of the Nigerian army constitutional responsibility as an army. He noted that Army also recognized that the Senate Committee has legislative oversight which keeps the Nigerian Army in check in the performance of the constitutional responsibility. And uh, I want to pledge the readiness of the Nigerian Army to continue to work harmoniously with the Senate Committee on Army and the larger legislative body towards ensuring that we perform our constitutional responsibility as an army effectively and in meeting the needs of uh, the generality of Nigerians. The Nigerian army will continue to conduct operations in the field to combat the myriad of our security challenges that confront us across the country and will bring uh, the military instrument of national power to bear in other areas where we can provide interventions and relief to Spite TV News report that a draft of legislative agenda was handed over to the Chief of Army Staff by the Chairman's Senate Committee on Army on behalf of the committee. You know, their, their needs and to see how we can uh, harmonize some of these things in the budget reform and then uh, make sure that the Nigerian Army is up to date in terms of tactical um, uh, requirements. A presentation was made on how the Nigerian Army is organized, the activities, especially the operations conducted in the field, 
and through the presentation they highlighted some of the challenges the Nigerian army is confronting the conduct of the operations and other activities. The Nigerian army will continue to conduct operations in the field to combat the mirage of the security challenges that confronts the country and also bring the military instruments of national power to bear in other areas where Nigerian army can provide intervention and relief to Nigerians. Meanwhile, the Director, Army Public Relations, Brigadier General Oyeman Wachuku has decorated four soldiers of the Directorate who were among the beneficiaries of Sergeant to Staff Sergeant, Staff Sergeant to Warrant Officer, Corporal to Sergeant, and private to last corporate promotion approved by the Army Council for the year 2023. Speaking of the decoration ceremony, the director who congratulated them for their commitment and from earning the promotion stressed that the promotion has not stopped there but has opened a new chapter for them to start afresh again because they must move to the next rank, and to get the next rank, they must work harder, more diligent, and dedicated. I would like to begin by formally congratulating the celebrants, the newly promoted uh, senior NCOs and um, soldier. I want you to understand one fact. A promotion comes as a result of what? As a result of diligence, dedication, hard work, discipline, and loyalty. It doesn't come from the blues. It does not come from the blues. You work for it, you earn it. And um, you have earned your promotion, each and every one of you. Invariably, it means you have contributed to the pursuit of the constitutional mandate of the Nigerian army. You have contributed to the pursuit of the command philosophy of the chief of army staff. You have contributed to the peace and stability of Nigeria. So I want to really, really congratulate you for your commitment and for earning this promotion. Now, you must realize that it doesn't stop there. It has opened a new chapter for you to start afresh again because you must move to the next rank. And to get to the next rank, what are you going to do? They're going to work harder. They're going to work what? Harder. They are going to be more diligent. They are going to be more dedicated. So I will urge you not to rest on your oars. Those decorated today were Staff Sergeant Jamini Unisar to Warrant Officer, also known as a Complaint Sergeant Major, Private Mohammed Usman to Last Copra, Copra Zurumba Williams to Sergeant, and Sergeant Unisar Tairo to Staff Sergeant. Promotion comes as a result of diligence, dedication, hard work, discipline, and loyalty. Olaemi Esson, Post by TV.